everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Deus Ex Human Revolution. Now we need to. Sorry. Now we need to go and find all three of these guys. So I'll be right back once we get at least somewhat nearest to one of them. Uh oh! I got caught. This could be bad. It's okay though, cause he got knocked it out. It's okay, it's fine! Everything is fine! Everything is not awful! This can be bad. Jeebus! Jeebus! Save me, Jeebus! Okay. Uh. I'm fine! Everything is okay! Holy crap, this is a bad place to be. I'm just gonna... Yeah. Nuh-uh! Lies and slander! Nuh-uh! Nuh-uh! I ain't going nowhere, bro. Don't worry about it, it's fine. <laughs> I'm going nowhere, it's fine! I'm just invisible. And they have no idea where I am. <laughs> oh, bejeebus. Oh, bye bejeebus. Bye. Oh, got into the butt. Wait for him to fall over. Bye! Tee. 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 I'm just gonna... Yeah. I got a lot of those guys, so I can... Wait, what? Ah! Wrong thing! Never mind, I used the wrong thing. Uh-oh. <laughs> Um... Just throw it! Throw it! Gas grenade! Whoops. Um... They found me! Throw another one! <laughs> when I doubt, throw another one! Don't worry about it. It's fine. Suppression fire. <laughs> what suppression fire? They don't know where I am. <laughs> awesome. No. Uh oh, there's more of them. <laughs> no, darn it! <laughs> I was so close. I was so close. I is the bliss. Oops. Well, let's try it again. It'll be fine. It'll be fine! It'll be completely fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, I'm still invisible. Um... Let's not be invisible anymore. No more invisible! Got him. Oh, right in the head! He got knocked the hell out. <laughs> uh, let's go back to... There we go. Got let me in! Dude, I need to talk to you! Hi. Get the hell out. This lab is off limits to you people. Dude! Naya! Hi! You too, Dr. Hi. What? Wait a second. I know you. Yep. You were Seraph's security guy. Yep. Way to protect our asses. Hey! hey check the don't edge. be a you dick! Fell. I nearly died trying to save you. Oh, and now you're here to take me back. Well, maybe I don't want to go. Maybe I've got more here than I ever had at Seraph. Do, do you? Did Sevchenko agree with that? They executed him and dumped his body in a ditch. 
That's not true. It totally is. I found him. Unless these murderers have you so brainwashed, you don't mind building their toys. It wasn't a toy. It, it was a software upgrade that limits functionalities in a biochip. They told me it was for crowd control. Is Vasily really dead? You saw the body? What was left well, of it? part oh of it. God. I should have listened to him. Dr. Colvin, I need to locate the rest of the team. But Dr. Reed's GPL isn't broadcasting. She's in the secured zone. Of course she Power is! Everywhere. Then I need a way to get the guards out. A distraction. Maybe a lab accident, what do you say? After what those bastards did to Vasily? Yay! Of course. But one minor incident in this lab won't be enough. No. But if a couple of other labs go up, simultaneously... Gotta go talk to the other ones! Eric. Of course. Interesting idea, Mr. Jensen. Ambitious, but risky. The timing will be critical. I'll coordinate the attack. But you understand that this could all backfire. Yep! I'm no shrinking violet, Mr. Jensen, but... There may be another issue. Of course! Checking your GPLs, aren't Yep. They? I've been wondering how to get around that. Smart man. Just like Vasily. He had a plan to shut down their tracking and jamming protocols using a virus. Okay. Maybe Declan or Eric know something more about it. From what I, from what I know about this game, the I last scientist you find is the one that has the virus. He's working in a lab on the third floor. There's an elevator that might get you there. It's on the second floor, though, and I heard the guard say something about that floor being shut off. Great. But then again, Great. with those neural enhancements of yours, you might find a way to get into it. Oh, yeah. Dr. Faraday doesn't seem to be working in this building. Any idea where he is? I think he's in the biomech lab next door. But you don't have to go outside to reach him. Really? There's a skywalk that connects the two buildings. Maybe you can use it. Well, that's helpful. Let's hope I just don't get caught on the sky bridge. Dr. Colvin, I need to know I can trust you. You seemed pretty happy to be here until I told you about Dr. Sevchenko. It's been six months, Mr. Jensen. Not long for you, perhaps. But how long can a person live in constant fear? Once they took us out of isolation, it just seemed easier to concentrate on the work. So you got hella Stockholm Syndrome. Vasily didn't. Maybe not Declan either, but the work we do here, the discussions, and the theories. I thought Seraph's projects were far-reaching, but the experiments I've seen going on here, it's the kind of stuff DARPA dreams up every day. That doesn't make it a good that thing! Governmental oversight keeping you in line. I suppose I'm just a typical scientist to you, right, Mr. Jensen? Blindly pushing boundaries? No care for who's footing the bill or how our discoveries get made? Yeah. We all have to live with <laughs> ourselves at the end of the day, Dr. Colvin. You're right, of course. But were things so different in Detroit? We all know where those Seraph contracts came from, don't we? You asked me if you could trust me. You can. But you better get on with this. Okay! Okay. Wait for my signal, Dr. Colvin. When your GPL starts to vibrate, set off the distraction. I understand. How am I gonna set off his GP her GPL and vibrate it? I'm sorry for what I said earlier. Good, you better be, or I'll shoot you in the face. It'll just get Shrek. Could I have snuck in here? Probably. Okay, now we have to go find the other dude. Without getting caught. Easier said than done, as per usual. Uh, ooh. Could get in there, perhaps. Or I could just punch this wall in. Fuck! <laughs> Why does that make me so happy? He's right above me. He is literally directly above me. Is there a vent? Can I knock out the ceiling or something? No? Balls. Anything over here? Oh, hey! Well, isn't that useful? Itchy eye. Sneaks! Hi! Ah, oh, how are you doing, lady? You making out with yourself or something? I, d uh, I don't know, have fun. Uh-oh. You don't see shit. I'm gonna go talk to this dude. What do you want? Hi! I told you people not to barge in here. Wasn't the new biochip design enough? No. Nope. Dr. Koss, I'm here to get you out. Jensen? From Sarif? 
But we were told we'd been written off. Not by me! Exactly. Listen, Jensen. They forced me to work for them. I didn't want to create the new biochip, especially since it was based on Sarif's research, but they didn't give me a choice. No one doubts your loyalty, Dr. Koss. Do you know what they plan to do with this new biochip? Really evil stuff, sure. probably. They said something about having Tai Young Medical produce it and distribute it through Lim, but I, I can't be sure. I know, and I'm here to bring you all back. But to reach Megan, I need you, Colvin, and Faraday to stage lab accidents as a distraction, simultaneously. Isn't that a little risky? Just a little! Besides, how will we coordinate these accidents? Uh, it's impossible. Maybe not. But it's that or staying here and eventually ending up like Dr. Sevchenko. They killed him, didn't they? Yep! He, he kept provoking them, coming up with these wild escape plans. They try to keep us apart as much as possible now. Well, that's rude. All right, Mr. Jensen. I'm with you. What's our next move? We need to disable their GPL tracker. I know Dr. Sevchenko was working on something. Viruses! Yeah, a, a virus program. <laughs> we all thought it was too risky considering we had nowhere to go. But I don't have it. You'd better check with Nia or Declan. So it would be Declan. Declan, right. Dr. Cost, do you have any idea where they're keeping him? I, I might. I, I overheard some of the guards. I, I think he might be working in the basement of the biomech labs. And we have to get into but the I, other building with the sky I'm bridge sure. to do it. What about the biochip? Dr. Koss, the bioship you mentioned was based on Sarif studies? Yes, I believe so. Uh, at first I thought it was merely convergent research, but uh, I've worked with Dr. Reed long enough to recognize her handiwork. Uh, besides, I had been working on something similar back in Detroit. And your knowledge okay. is valuable here. At least so they certain, can't kill you. Uh, it probably helped us all stay alive. But now with Dr. Shevchenko, I guess we've all become expendable. Except for Reed. Except for Dr. Reed, I suppose. Yep. Why do you say that? It's more of a general feeling, I guess. Back in Detroit, uh, we all realized that we were on the verge of something groundbreaking. And here, well... Everyone seems to view her research as crucial in some way. That Interesting. Being held in a secured area. Because they don't want her to get away. I'm just glad we're going home. It's kind of hard to believe. It's okay, we'll get you out of there. Don't worry Sit about tight, it. Sit tight, Dr. Cos. When you feel a vibration from your GPL, set off that distraction. That'll be the signal. I will. Good luck, Mr. Jensen. And hurry. Yes. Yay, I got a practice point. Okay. So we gotta go find... One more dude, and he's all the frickin' way over there, great. Hmm. This is bad. I'm going back this way. <laughs> it seems like a smarter idea. Less likely to get me murdered in my face hole, because I don't want to get murdered in my face hole. I need, still need to find my girlfriend, who we will probably find in this episode, which would be awesome. Uh oh. <laughs> you don't see shit. You don't see shit. Wait for it. Run, 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 run! Okay, we got a sky bridge. So this must be the sky bridge that they were talking about. Okay. Gotta go save the last dude. In the basement! <laughs> uh oh. Just gonna... Oh, I don't think I got him. Got him that time! <laughs> Guess that's one way to deal with him. Got him. Okay, I think it's just the two. I want to say it's just the two. Yeah, because I only see the two. Okay. Into the basement! Be down there. Oh, hey! <laughs> oh, hi hey there! Can I just break the glass and just fly down all epic style? No? Balls. 
Okay then, how do I actually get down there? This way? Let me in! Okay, decontaminate my butt. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's the wrong way. <laughs> this is the way I was supposed to go. Okay. Now I just need to find another pair of some more stairs so I can get down to the basement. Was there anything I just missed back the way I came? Why does this area seem like a boss fight? Nope. So, must be this other direction. Take your stuff. Don't really... Do I have a gun that can use Typhoon ammo? I'm honestly not sure. Also, my nose is itchy. Itchy nose. <laughs> is it this way, then? Oh, yes, he dearie me. Oh, yes, he dearie me it is. Um, yoink. <laughs> mm, boom! I've got like ten of those. I think I'm okay to use a couple of them every occasionally. <gasps> Let me in. Let me in. Ba ba ba. Let me in. Gotta get down there. We gotta talk to the dude after we knock out whoever this joker is on my screen. Oh, he's on the other floor. Never mind. Mr. Man, do you have a virus? Well then. Rude. Such rudeness here. Hello? Mr. Man, are you in here? Sup, nerd? Adam? Adam? At least he recognizes me. Good grief. Lad. Off the bat. What the blaze has happened to you? Don't worry about I made it. I a mistake <laughs> of surviving. I'm here to get you out, Dr. Faraday. I told the silly that Seraph wouldn't stop looking. So His head's really dead, small. Dr. Faraday. I'm sorry. I figured as much. One day, he was just gone, and they wouldn't say why. We were all afraid, so we just kept to the work. They forced me to create a signal pattern that could broadcast software upgrades directly into a person's implanted circuitry. That's upgrades. disturbing! But do what? whatever instructions have been encoded into them. They said it was to improve efficiency at clinics, but that wouldn't be the only application. No, God, no. Far from it. I see. Dr. Faraday, we need to free Megan from the isolation zone. I've got a plan to distract the guards. Three lab accidents. <laughs> I like your style, son. I like this guy. And He's my just friend. Like work <laughs> if you can get Nia and Eric to agree. But timing them to occur at once, that will be the trick. I'll worry about the timing. For now, sit tight and wait for my signal. There's one thing you're forgetting, lad. They can track our GPL signals. I know. That's rude. But I'm hoping you might have the solution to that problem. Sevchenko's viral program. Do you have it? Of course. <laughs> I shouldn't have underestimated him. I really like this guy. He's the a cool person. Gave it to me before he disappeared. Here you are. Upload it onto the central security computer. It will scramble their scanners. I would have done it myself, but... I'm just a scientist. Don't sell Aww. yourself short. I like this guy. Tell me, where do I find this security terminal? The silly told me Bone, shut a up. To it, near the back of the compound. Bone. I but Don't call I'm me. I'm afraid you'll have to explore it. Who's sure. calling me? I'm in the middle of an episode of recording Nina's. This I don't know this number. Go away. Any idea who's behind Bone, I stop? swear to God. The kidnapping, the facility. You are now going on silence. Remarkable, considering I've been here six months. You would have thought someone would let something slip. But if it doesn't have to do with the research, you don't get a word out of them. Sounds like the guards are well trained. Or they're just rude. What kind of threats were needed to stop the other researchers from talking? Well, there were threats early on just to get us to work. Of course, Vasily saw right through that. Kept saying they needed us. I suppose in his case, the risk outstripped the return at some point. Probably. Damn them. Dr. Sevchenko probably knew the risks and accepted them. That he did. Go on, lad. Let's put this plan of yours into action. It's time to teach these wankers a lesson. Yeah! I like these guys. I uh, leave. Once I Let's get out of here. It'll be time to act. I'll signal you. A vibration in your GPL. Be ready. Understood, lad. 
but do be careful. Yeah, sure. Okay, we need to upload the virus into the security computer, and oh god, it's all the freaking way over there. Great. Let's get the hell out of here. Whee! Whee! Run, 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 run. So this is probably going to take a while, because I have to get all the way over to wherever the hell that is. But we're going to get to see Megan soon. We might even see Megan this episode, depending on how long things take. Uh -huh. Okay, it's on this floor, so I don't need to go up any more floors. I just need to get out of here. Which means going back... This way. Yeah. Can I go up here? Is this a good place to be? Maybe. Perhaps. Possibly not. Experience points and now that that goes somewhere it goes pretty much nowhere great ooh tranquilizer darts always need tranquilizer darts cuz I'm pacifist um okay time to get out of here Whee! Whee! I take no fall damage. Okay, so I need to go that way. Don't know if it's back in the building I was just in, or if it's even further than that, so it'll take me a little bit to get there. Okay, guys, we're almost there. I just gotta sneak past these jokers. Mmm, there's a security bot. Gotta be careful not to set off the security bot. I- I- I'm- I'm- I'm stuck. I'm- I'm- I'm stuck. There we go. Not supposed to be stuck. Oh, I'm supposed to go past there. Balls. Hut. Come on, just slip past him. There we go. And hopefully there's nobody in here. There is not. Bingo! Okay, is there anything in here I can steal? More EMP grenades and mine templates. Great. Like, I don't have those already. I'll use a security hub. Why not? Hack the crap out of that? Because, oh dear. <sighs> Great. Cry money, cry money, cry money, cry money. Cry me, cry me, cry money. There, take that, take that, capture that, capture that, capture everything! Access Boom! Granted. Everything is captured! Uh, let's disable the robots. Oh, they're disabled, never mind. Boink! Upload the virus. Yay, now they can't get found. tracking the scientists? Of course. Simulate feedback along that route. Make it strong enough to vibrate their implants. They have to feel it. A signal, eh? Yep. Not bad, Jensen. I'm sending it now. <gasps> Pritchard gave me a compliment! <sighs> Pritchard complimented me! It's a gosh darn miracle! Uh oh. Over there! Hold it! Stop it. Ow! Now. Rude. Then I'm dead. <laughs> Well then, that just happened. <laughs> it's okay, I can fix this. It's fine. Pritchard, are you still tracking the scientists? Of course. Simulate feedback along that route. Make it strong enough to vibrate their implants. They have to feel it. I have to feel it! I have to feel it! I'm sending it now. No. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Uh oh. Nearing source of disturbance. We know someone's here. Keep looking. Nah. -uh. 
I'm not here, don't worry about it. <laughs> it's fine, just sleep. Just sleep. Wait, what? Over there! Hold it! Nope! <laughs> Fuck! And now we run so we can get in there and save my girlfriends! Megan! Anything in here? Ooh! I'm gonna close this for a second. Got ourselves a 9mm pistol and a lot of heavy rifle ammo. Some sniper rifle ammo. Some, some ammo for guns I don't use. Great. Um... Can't really use most of these. Oh well! Is there anything that I can use these on? No, no. Balls. Well, I can at least pick that up if there's a heavy rifle ammo and the obvious boss fight that's gonna be obvious that comes up pretty soon. I mean, if there's not a boss fight before you get to Megan Reed, then I don't even know what. I don't even know what. I don't even know what. Whoops. I hit the wrong button. I meant to put my gun away and instead I threw an EMP. Gross? Why? Who in the world came up with this little display? Your tenacity, Adam Jensen. Is oh God damn it! Not you again. Irritating. We'd like you to stop now. I'm no. Afraid I can't, Sal. I'm looking for my girlfriend. You see, I figured it out. I know what you and your conspiracy buddies are planning. Do you? How clever. How about I just shoot you in the face now? Biochip. A software upgrade that limits what augmentations can do. You're creating a kill switch. You kidnap Megan Reed's team to do it, and you're seizing control of the market to ensure it gets distributed. All because you're afraid of people like me. Augmented people, with the power to resist you. Yep, well partially. No one's afraid of you, Mr. Jensen. All your blundering around and childish interference hasn't stopped a thing. Tell me, have you been to a limb clinic lately? No. I didn't get the change! I didn't get the change! Let me guess. I knew it was a trap! That was supposed to shut me down. I knew it was a trap! Leave me broken knew it. and begging. The Orgs were recalled. You should be offline! <laughs> Why is my game lagging? There we go. Now it isn't. Uh-oh. Hi! You should have stayed dead, Jensen. It's the guy who tried to kill me in the beginning of the game! All right, let's do this. Nice outfit there, bro. Boss fight! This is bad. Behind you, Jensen. Shut up, Namir. Nobody likes you, Namir. Okay, so we gotta kill Namir. Where is he? Where is he? How can a man so long? Wait, what? What? <laughs> Did I just glitch out the game so I can do a takedown on a boss? Down and he died. <laughs> you can do that? Okay, um. That boss fight, though. 
That boss fight, though. Megan! Everything got quiet. Megan? <gasps> Megan! Jaren, is that you? Megan! Not exactly. Adam? Oh my god, Adam. It's you. <gasps> I'm alive! It's a bitch! You're hurt. What happened? What happened to you? I risked my life for you, Megan. I came halfway around the world, and for what? It's not what you think. Are you part of this? No! No, Adam, I swear it! The kidnapping was real. The attack on Seraph Industries, they came after me. They wanted my research. And when did you decide they could have it? It didn't happen like that. I wanted to tell you, but I couldn't. I couldn't! And then David said we had to use it. We owed it to mankind. David? What are you talking about? My great discovery. The genetic framework I found that makes it easier for living tissue to bond with implants. I found it. In you, Adam. Da -da -da! <laughs> he had the mutations. I, tell you, I swear. But David convinced me what it could mean for mankind. How much better off we could all be. It took Hugh to He's subject me zero. How I was. Hugh? Hugh Darrow. He owns this facility. After Namir brought us here. Richard! Patch me into Sarah. Now! Adam, please! He was only pretending to work with Tai Young and the others. He found out what they were planning to do and told them he would help. But only to make sure they never succeeded. Their control signal won't work. Yes, it'll do something much worse! Megan, you fucking idiot! Ladies and gentlemen. He's <laughs> asked me to show the world how human enhancement technology can change it. After careful deliberation, I've decided I must do exactly that. Forgive me. <laughs> Megan, what have you done? Megan! He's modified the control signal. Anyone with a new biochip will be affected. Hugh never said anything about this. I'm going back for the scientists. No, Adam. I know the complex better than you. I'll find them. There's a hangar bay through there. Get to its control room and retract the roof. Clear a path for us. <laughs> nice little... Just get together that was, Megan! <laughs> Jesus Christ! What kind of room is this anyway? Megan, what the fuck? Crash test dummy. Megan! Megan, what the shit? Megan! Lady! God damn it, Megan. God damn it, Megan. So yeah, just like I thought and just from the side quests and stuff, I am patient zero. I am patient zero. <sighs> Sigh. Sigh. Hacking the shit out of all this. Boom. I'm hacking your Chrome te or Chrome computer, Megan. I'm gonna read your diary. Just like back at you for this shite. Bajic Areneola. Great, so now we've got all of these bio engineered -y peoples all growing completely ape shit. Okay. So everybody who has a new biochip is now gone completely AWOL because Hugh Darrow messed with the control signal that the Illuminati wanted to use. Fucking great. Broadcast frequencies are going haywire. How are you, Malik? Is that you? Where are you? Coming into visual range of Singapore. Malik! <laughs> Yay! Good timing. I'm heading for a hangar bay to open the roof. We'll need an emergency extraction. Roger that. I'm on my way. Let's do this. Well, they're all having difficulties. I hit the button. Hey, Jensen! <gasps> Looks like you could use some help! Malik? Malik? Oh, Malik! <laughs> Malik, I fucking I love you. Scientist, Jensen. I'm landing nearby. And I think... Dr. Reed wants to speak to I you. I don't see him. Hang on. Oh, they're there. How do you know she wants to speak to you? She's still over there. <laughs> Hi, Megan. 
I love you, but you're kind of a jerk. <laughs> Itchy. Hello? Adam? We're all fine, but you have to get to Panchea and stop Hugh. You and I aren't done with this, Megan. Yeah! I know how it looks, but you have to stop the broadcast. I think it's causing the new biochips to overstimulate the vagus nerve, creating terrifying hallucinations. You mean it's driving augmented people insane? Yep. Yes, and it's up to you to stop it. Use the Leo shuttle. It will take you to Panchea. Good luck, Adam. We need to have a talk, Megan! You and I need to have a really long, lengthy, heart-to-heart -heart discussion? Are these guys all dead? Yep. They're, um... They're, they're, they're very dead. Hopefully that doesn't mess up my... Well, it shouldn't, because I didn't kill them. Malik killed them. So it's fine. As long as Malik killed them, I can take their candy bars. <laughs> Let's go to Panchea! We need to stop this signal so all the augmented people stop going absolutely batshit bonkers. Alright, I'm gonna hit this button. Automated systems online. Great. Darrow sequence one, code one, one A. Preset and ready to engage. That means nothing to me. Suborbital trajectory plotted. What? Destination. Suborbital tra- what? Begin countdown, Mr. Darrow. Ha! 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 He thinks I'm Darrow. Begin countdown. Let's go! Code. Zero, zero, zero. Confirm, zero. Countdown commences. Shittiest code ever. Wait, am I going into a shuttle and we're getting just shot into space? <laughs> am I going to space? I wanna go to space. Come on, Jensen, we're going to Panchea. Alright. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> I am, I'm going to space! No, I want to keep looking at space! I wanted to keep looking at space. <laughs> I like space. Space is my friend. Uh oh. Shoot failure. Oh, that's not good. That that that's not good. I'm gonna drown. Drowning is bad. Don't do that. I can't swim. So that's true. I can't swim. I can float my back for a little bit. Oh, I got out. Never mind. <laughs> um. Okay. I'ma just put away my gun. I can't see my mouse, so I have to leave my keyboard, so I have to leave Jensen, back. Can you read me? Pritchard! Barely. I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any word from Sarah for the UN delegates? Nothing. The installation went into lockdown shortly after Darrow gave his speech. Great. I can't tell if anyone's even alive. And the signal's still broadcasting. That's not good. No one's safe till I get in there and shut it down. Yep. You'll have to disengage the lockdown first. Look for a master control panel at the top of the tower. This is where Darrow is. Oh, this is where everything just went. Oh, crap. This is where everything just went down. This is where Seraph went. Uh oh. <laughs> we have now entered a horror game. Because we are in an area full of crazy augmented people. Hello? Well, that's bad. Good thing it doesn't affect me, right? Because I've got the stuff for that. Okay, give me this. Oh, wait, I needed that, didn't I? <laughs> Just gonna... What? What? Ah, that's one way to do it. Okay. Gotta be super sneaks. Okay, this is a bad place to be.
better idea. Just gotta get... There we go. I'm taking this! <laughs> I need it! I need it for stuff! Wait, what? Oh, right! I have the augment that says fuck, fuck your electrified water. But not fuck your explosives. Okay, good to know. <laughs> I forgot I had the one that's like, oh, is there um, electricity on the floor? Don't worry about it, bro. I love my augments. They're my friends. Okay. I think I actually have some... The music completely cut out. That's weird! All I hear is heartbeat. Okay, we have a praxis point. And now I really feel like I'm talking to myself because there's no music. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna go ahead and snag... that guy. Just in case. I don't know if we have a actually have any more boss fights after this, but... La da 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 da! La 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 la! Whee! Okay. Can I get it from there? There we go. Boom! Boom, bitch. Boom, bitch. Look at that face. Well, it's flooded. Hello? Oh, wait. This is the wrong way, isn't it? Because I have to go that way. <laughs> I'm going the wrong direction like normal! Let me up. Uh oh, more explosives. Fuck! Aw. Mmm, fuck! Low ammo? I have 28 bullets, bro. Uh, that gun. Hello? Uh... Seraph? Darrow? Anybody? Hello? Hello, monsters? Hello, the demons well then. <laughs> Freight elevator! Richard, Gatchea's broadcast center is at the base of the station near the bottom of the ocean. Yeah. Is that right? But the lockdown caused all the blast doors to seal. You won't be able to go down until you open Great! The Thanks, Pritchard. I, the tower. I, got it. I guess we have to override everything from the top of the tower so we can go down to the bottom of the ocean and turn off this gosh darn signal. That must be a really strong network signal in order to broadcast from the bottom of the ocean. Oh. Well, they're dead. Uh-oh, we got- we got baddies. It's probably just insane people. They're not doing this of their own free will! They're not doing this because they want to! They're doing this because the game demands it. Balls. I want that. Can I use this? No. You know what? These are useless to me. We're at the end of the game. I'm just dropping them. Um, dead bodies! All over the place. Great. Excellent. Okay! You have fun there, Mr. Crazy Man. I'm gonna go this way, okay? I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just gonna go around you. Oh my god, that's gorgeous. Okay. I can't wait for Mankind Divided, because this game already is absolutely stunningly gorgeous. I haven't saved in a while. What? <laughs> Yeah, I can't go into that vent. Anything here? I credit shit that I don't need. And a hypostem that I also don't need. Great. I don't think I've used any of the drugs yet. Guess I'm going up this way. 
That's a lot of dead people. Ooh, I want to go into here, so I'm just gonna do that. And accidentally equip the wrong things again, like usual. Let me in. Plasma capsules for the plasma gun that I didn't grab from Namir. Oops. Oh well, doesn't matter anyway because I'm all kinds of uh, nice and pleasant and not killy people. Not killing people is a technical term. Fuck. You know what? Maybe if I'm really careful I can throw this far enough? Where's my G? There it is. There we go! It's gonna explode. Never mind, no it's not. Jeebus, that's a lot of dead people! That is definitely, definitely a lot of dead people. Oh. Um. Guess I'm going through the window. Oh dear. This is where the thing happened. With the stuff. Every- wait, how did you Daryl get out of this just fine? If he did get out of it just fine. I don't think you want to do that, Mr. Jensen. Disengage lockdown. Hi! The demons this station contains are likely to come crashing out on us. Afraid to die, Daryl? Or just unwilling to face what you've done? Oh, I know what I've done. Believe me. You've got a lot I of blood no on that pain. staff. And yet you still did it. I did what had to be done. Twenty years ago, I gave the world augmentation technology. I thought I was giving it a bright future, but instead I gave it the means to destroy itself. No law, no UN regulation was going to fix that. People are dying out there. Hundreds of thousands of people driven to the brink of insanity because of you. I had to convince the world. Before today, people believed we should steal fire from the gods and redesign human nature. Human nature is the only thing we have that gives us a moral compass and the social skills we need to live in peace. Destroy it, and you destroy our very species. You're destroying our species for what you just did! What you're doing is insane. Is it? When this is done, the Illuminati won't be able to control men and women like you as they had planned from the inside out. No one will be able to use the technology I invented to make others into beings they desire. Something we both know has happened already. I was augmented without my permission! Frankenstein. Killing his own monster. Actually, Mr. Jensen, I prefer to think of myself as Daedalus, watching helplessly as his child crashes into the sea. Like I did when I got here. Darrow, I swear to God. I'm ending this. Now. Oh dear, here we go. You can't. The signal is being generated from the broadcast. Receptive, confident, the pragmatic. Banchea's security system has been programmed to protect it. And will kill you before you even get close. You designed that system, Darrow. Okay, here we go. Down. But I won't. You think what I'm doing is extreme. You simply don't understand. For humanity to survive beyond this century, it must abandon ill-conceived notions about transcendence and embrace change. But for that to happen, the hard lesson must be learned. Blood must be shed. That's not how this works. Okay. Mmm. You love to embrace your change. Um... Um. My God, Daryl, please think of the individuals you're hurting. Innocent women and children, some of whom had no choice when they got augmented. Every second that signal continues to broadcast, more of them will die. Help me stop this, please. Dad, you good? You think to sway me by forcing me to- Son of a bitch! 
I created something magnificent and watched it turn to ashes. And the lesson I learned from my suffering is exactly the lesson that's in play here. But you, I don't expect you to understand. Oh no, like Tiger, my persuasion level went down. And all the others. You can't see beyond yourself. None of you has the vision to understand the necessity of my actions here today. I do. This is the ravings of a mass murderer. Critique. You've convinced yourself you're right, but whatever moral high ground you're standing on is nothing but a stack of innocent victims. You're trying to justify genocide. All your talk about ethics and ideals doesn't mean a damn compared to that. You think my methods are inhuman? Yes! <laughs> Don't you yes, my persuasion went up! I created okay, good. people like you. I made it possible for you to happen. If fate had dealt me a different hand, then perhaps... Perhaps neither of us would... This be is my favorite happy. kind of boss fight. Isn't it obvious how fate is now conspiring mm. to overtake us both? To grind us beneath her wheels? We must see this through. Lest people like you continue to evolve and destabilize society. Try for a beta appeal. Maybe, Maybe someone like me can't understand how dangerous this technology is. Maybe I do need you to remind me what it is to be human. To show compassion for the people out there. People who've already learned Come the on. message and who just need this to stop. Oh, very nice, Mr. Jensen. Son of a bitch! Attempting to manipulate my emotions like the true sociopath you have become and proving my point once again. Well, it will not work. Son of a bitch! Go! See for yourself the future this technology offers. I wonder if it will give you nightmares, as it has me. Yeah, well go fuck yourself. <laughs> Nothing that he could have done could have caused... Could have Richard, just none of it. Down's disengaged. I'm heading back to the hangar to see if those blast doors are open. Have you been able to raise anyone? I'm picking up several glimmers, but there's too much interference. I... I think you're on your own, Jensen. Pritchard? Careful there, Francis. You almost sound like you regret that. Huh? <laughs> Aww. Okay, we're on our own. Great. Wonderful. Fucking glorious. We will finish the game in the next episode, you guys. Because we got shit to do, it seems. But my name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am playing some Deus Ex Human Revolution, and holy shit! I will see you all in the next episode.